night before Christmas, and all through the house not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were strung by the chimney with care, in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were nestled all snug in their beds, with visions of sugar plums dancing in their heads. I wonder who that could be. Who is knocking at this hour? Oh. I think it's the mailman late with the mail again. I don't know why he's coming tonight. <laughs> come in, come in. How are you guys? Hello. Oh, hi. Merry Christmas. <laughs> How are you? Well, Good. we're doing wonderfully. Maddie and I were just driving through the area looking at Christmas lights and thought we'd stop in to see you guys. Well, we're glad for a visit. How was the Christmas shopping this year, Maddie? Oh, busy as always, but we managed to get all the kids gifts in time. Is that a new piano over there? It is. It was a Christmas gift from Nick. Would you two like to play? We'd love to. Go ahead. could play like that. Well, we did major in music, Nick. How did you not know? <laughs> College was a hazy time. College was only seven years ago, Nick. How do you not remember? Don't you remember meeting them after musical theater ensemble? Oh, yeah, yeah. I do remember now. I do. Another, another visitor. Oh, who could be that person? <laughs> Oh, these people, okay. Come on in. Hi, Claudia. I have that package for you in the other room. They're here to pick up the gift for the children at St. Peter's. Oh, okay, okay. Let's go get a drink.
found out anything about the surprise party yet? You know how oblivious he is. We threw him a, we threw him a surprise birthday party once, and when we all jumped out and yelled, happy birthday, he asked whose birthday it was. <laughs> He probably won't realize that this is a party for him unless someone just bursts in. I hope in. I didn't miss the <laughs> Niccolo Alessandrini, this is a surprise party for Nick. Do not spoil it. You know how much he loves Christmas. I know. I know. I'm excited to give him his present is all. Nick, it's empty. I know. Come on. Look who's here. Merry oh, Christmas. Oh my goodness. How are you? Not too bad. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> How are you? I haven't seen you in a long time. I'm just tr trying to keep warm. I feel the pain. I feel the pain. How about yourself? Well, I'm still living. Good. Good to hear. Yeah. You know what I haven't heard in a long time? What's that? The Little Drummer Boy. I was thinking about that the other day. Oh, yeah. That's, uh, that's that song that goes on. Peace on the... Right? I'm pretty sure there's peace on earth. <laughs> I think you're right. Would you give me a B flat, please? <laughs> right now. You are just... It is Christmas. <laughs> we are doing this for Nick. If you two don't have anything nice to say, then don't say anything at all. Yes, Olivia. <laughs> you two were never this angry when you were married. Thank you. 
I really, I really do think that Christmas really starts when that first snow falls. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas With every Christmas card I write May your days, may your days be merry and bright I really do hope all of you guys' Christmases For me? <laughs> really? Oh. You got, oh, I love you guys so much. Mary, you know, come on, you love Christmas and uh, wanted to throw a surprise party for you. <laughs> um, Nick? Nick? Yeah. Yeah, this is, this is a family moment. <laughs>
goodness, would you look at the time? It's getting late. I have to get home and decorate the Christmas tree with my family. No, you can't go. We haven't even opened gifts yet. Everyone else seems to be singing with each other. Would you like to sing with me? Sh sure, what should we sing? Well, what's your favorite thing about Christmas? Mm, I, oh, I really love decorating the Christmas tree. That's one of my favorites, too. I also really love drinking hot chocolate and listening to sleigh bells. That's it. What? We can sing silver bells. OK. Absolutely. Annie, thank you. 
anything for you, darling. <clears throat> Have a holly jolly Christmas, it's the best time of the year. I don't know if there'll be snow, so have a cup of cheer. Have a holly jolly Christmas, and when you walk down the street, say hello to friends you know and everyone you meet. Hey ho, the mistletoe strung where you can see somebody's waiting there kiss her once for me have a holly jolly christmas and in case you didn't hear oh by golly have a holly jolly christmas this year <laughs> I've always, I miss my brother, Adam. He always loved Christmas as much as I did. I'm dreaming tonight of a place I love even more than I usually And although I know it's a long road back, I promise you I'll be home for Christmas. You can count on me. have snow and mistletoe and presents on the tree. Christmas Eve will find me where the love light gleams.
still can't believe he's here with her. She's just so, so blonde. She's a brunette. I guess you don't get the turn of phrase. I guess I'm dating a blonde too. <laughs> just look at her, having a happy little Christmas. You know what, John? I hope you have yourself a merry little Christmas. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Let your heart be light. From now on, our troubles will be out of sight. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Make the Yuletide. And what is that supposed to mean? I just hope you have a perfect Christmas, John. Oh, I plan on it, Stacy. Oh, Stacey. I'm sure you do. And me and Blake are gonna have a great Christmas with Trevor. Oh, don't even act like he could ever take my place in Trevor's well, heart. Well, he certainly did in mine. Oh, <laughs> oh, you know what? I am so sick of you always trying to pick a fight with me and always bringing up the dog. You know what? Well, why can't you just get over me already? Why can't I get over you? Yes. Clearly, you're the one with the problem. You brought Kaylee here just to ruin oh, my Christmas. Oh, no, that, that is that ridiculous. That is exactly you know. what you did. It's, you are trying to do everything you can to ruin my Christmas, especially what, after what you did last year. What did I even do last Christmas? Ah. Uh, uh, uh. Face a 
of a lover with a fire in his heart. A man undercover, but you tore me apart. Ooh, but now I found a real love. You'll never fool me again. Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. But the very next day, you gave it away. You gave it Wow. Stacy, I I didn't realize that you felt that way. I if I would have known, I, I would have I would have done better. I I would have been better. I I'm so sorry. It doesn't matter now. I could have been better too. No. You were perfect. John, I don't know what to say. How about I still love you? How about Trevor and I are coming home? <laughs> <laughs> well, this is awkward. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry about John. I, I know you really liked him. Oh, not really. Really? <laughs> he was always talking about Stacy and that dumb dog Trevor. Then, then why did you even date him? I actually didn't know he was taking me out until our third date. Oh. Well, can I tell you something? I've kind of always sort of liked you. Really? Yeah. What about Stacy? Well, she, you know, only brought me to spite John. Well, I guess it didn't work. Yeah. So. Hmm. Well, in all honesty, I only came here because I thought you might be here. Because all I really want for Christmas is you. Don't run so hard for Christmas. There's just one thing I need. I don't care about those presents underneath the Christmas tree. I just want you for my own. More than you could ever know. You make my wish come true. for Christmas. I won't even wish for snow. I won't even hang around the old mistletoe. No sense in hanging stockings there upon the fireplace cause Santa he won't make me happy with a toy on Christmas Day. Oh I just want you for my own to hold and kiss me. If everybody else is singing, we should probably sing too. Okay. I don't want to. <laughs> please? No. Purple, please? Um, uh, that All right. If Miriam wants me to, I will. Okay. Nuts roasting on an open fire. Chestnuts nipping at your nose. Yuletide carols being sung by a choir. And folks dressed up like Eskimos. Everybody knows how turkey and some mistletoe. Help to make the season bright. Sleep tonight. They know that Santa's on his way. He 
he's loaded lots of go toys and goodies on his sleigh. And every mother's child is gonna start to see if reindeer really know how to fly. And so I'm offering a simple phrase to kids from one to ninety-two. Although it's been said many times, many ways, Merry Christmas. Then let us be merry, put sorrow away. Our Savior Christ Jesus was born on this day. To Bethlehem City today, or it was, that Joseph and Mary together did pass. And for to be taxed, they when thither they came, when Caesar Augustus commanded the same. Then let us be merry, put sorrow away. Our Savior Christ Jesus was born on this day. Then let us be merry, put sorrow away. Our Savior Christ Jesus was born on this day. But Mary's full time being come, as we find, she brought forth her firstborn to save all mankind. Be in being for war this heavenly guest. No place there was found where to lay him to rest. Then let us be merry, put sorrow away. Our Savior Christ Jesus was born on this day. Then let us be merry, put sorrow away. Our Savior Christ Jesus was born on this day. Darling, I don't think you could have made this Christmas any better. Nick, look outside. It's snowing! Join 
this for more caroling. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Christmas is about who you are and the people around you, not what you have or what you don't have. And I'd like to thank all of you for joining my family and I this Christmas. So let us all have a merry, merry Christmas. Good.